6616. Now Three Forks will be busy this coming weekend. It's rodeo weekend. This weekend folks will also get a chance to learn a little bit about a great program helping people in the area as the Headwaters Area Food Bank will be featured during the rodeo parade as Grand Marshal. We recently visited the food bank to learn a little more. Well, good morning. We are in Three Forks. We're at the Headwaters Area Food Bank. Uh, Kim, uh, let's talk a little bit about the, the work that goes on out here. We uh, serve many people out here. We actually um, are food bank for about four different counties mm -hmm. and people that we in those counties. We serve about 91 people a month mm -hmm. out here, including children. And we do a lot of, um, well, we do summer lunch out here mm -hmm. for kids. Mm -hmm. And that's running between 70 to 100 kids also. And I know a lot of the work that goes on here, in fact, the bulk of it is done by volunteers. How important are your volunteers to you? Our volunteers are huge. All volunteers are huge. Mm -hmm. And um, they're what keep a lot of organizations going, actually, and, I'm, and ours particularly, mm -hmm. um, one of our awesome volunteers is it's a great transition uh, yes. <laughs> Taylor talk to me a little bit about why why would you be a volunteer here what what uh, inspires you to come and work here um, you know with my rodeo career the community has always been really supportive of me and how I do and so I wanted to find a way to give back mm -hmm. to the community and for all their support and really the best reward is the feeling that you get by volunteering so oh. I know that uh, the the Headwaters Area Food Bank is going to be a part of the rodeo coming up on the 19th and 20th out here. Um, as far as being a part of the parade and that, that's got to be a nice thing that two things that are very important to you are going to kind of be blurring together there. Yeah, it's super exciting and I'm really excited for the parade and the rodeo and it'll be a lot of fun. All right. Uh, when you decided that I kind of give back in some way, why the food bank? I just... It looked like a very welcoming and open place, and Kim is was always very supportive, and she's very supportive of my rodeo, and mm -hmm. I just felt at home here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's great, uh, Taylor. Thank you very much. I can't, let's talk about uh, the involvement with the uh, with the rodeo parade and all of that. Uh, what a great uh, way to get a little attention to the work that goes on here every day. Yes, um, I think it's great that the Three Forks community supports us so much, mm -hmm. and that they ask actually asked us or my volunteers to be the Grand Marshals of the parade mm -hmm. um, but we also want to really emphasize all the other volunteers in the community and how important they are you know to th the Three Forks area. Mm -hmm. um, volunteers are kind of the lifeblood of any good strong community aren't they? Yes they are they are. Uh, another thing that we're going to be doing is um, raising funds for our new building. Mm -hmm that we have um, we've been doing it all by volunteer work mm -hmm. and we're getting really close to being able to move in that's fantastic hey, Kim uh, Kim and uh, Taylor joining us this morning uh, thank you for your volunteer work and uh, thank you for the efforts that you do out here as well Kim. we're gonna take a quick break much more Montana this morning right